Hi, we're getting ready to do a firm and five workout to strengthen your back with the Hooked on Pilates Mini Max. Cross its width and the handy bands are attached at mid height in the door jam behind you. So you're gonna go ahead and come and lie down so where you feel comfortable. Grounding down through your toes, we're going to have those arms hovering. Stomach is drawn in as if the Mini Max feels hot to us. Squeeze your bottom, affirm your thighs, and from here, push, push. Slide the shoulders down away from your ears. Push on the other side, push, and slide. So yes, we're going to alternate our lead arm. And other side leads, and then both arms slide towards our waistline. You're trying to keep reaching the head away from your grounded heels. Abs stay in, bottom is squeezing nice and tight. Reach, reach, slide shoulders away from yours. Reach, reach, slide. Reach, reach, and slide. That's it. Feel those shoulder blades slide down away from your ears as your elbows bend. Abs are in, bottom is squeezing. And then from here, reach your arms to straight and then breaststroke like you're in the pool. So you can do it without lifting your chest, just doing the arm motion where you reach forward, draw back to a T, press forward on your exhale, draw back. Or you can add a little extension as the arms achieve the T, reach forward and reach back. Very good. Reach forward, come back to your T, squeezing your bottom. And it is totally fine just to do the arm motion and hold the body neutral or parallel to the floor. So now hold on to the edges of the mini mat. Just lift one leg up, squeeze that same side glute, drop that leg. And then to the other side, hold and lower. Very good, lift and lower. Lift, squeeze the same side glute and lower. Now if you wanna make it harder, let go of the mini max and lower. Lift and lower. Squeeze the same side glute, abs are in. Try to reach the top of your head away from your flexed heel. And abs stay in, like the mini max feels hot to you. Good, and let's have two more to each side. Excellent. Now one more to each side. Excellent. So we're going to try to work our multifidus. So go ahead and put your arms slightly forward. So my elbows, inside edges of my elbows are touching the mini max. From here I'm going to really squeeze my glute. I'm going to lift that bent elbow and I'm going to look at it having some rotation. And nice straight spine look and lower. So the multifidus works with extension and also with rotation. So just go as high as you can with lifting that elbow and looking at it, making sure to squeeze your bottom to help protect your back. But often the multifidus does not spontaneously recover after back injuries. So it is important to try to get that multifidus to wake up. Yes, squeezing glutes, drawing in your abs as you do this little rotation. Very good, let's have one more to each side. Okay, our final one here is slow swimmer. So I'm gonna push the left arm forward as I lift the right leg and then I lower. So I reach with one and lift with the other. Stretch, toe point in the back or foot flex, whatever works for you. I think foot flex is gonna work better for me because I'm kind of close to the wall. Abs in, squeeze same side glute, that's it. Stretch and lift, opposite leg. Working that spine, abs are in. Excellent work. And let's have one more to each side. 
Very good. Put your knuckles into the mini max and release. Very good. Just stretch here and allow your body to get soft and come to the floor. All right. That's it for that workout. Thanks so much.